get things going. What's good, everyone? I haven't posted a Call of Duty video in a, in a long time. Um, probably not even that long of a time. Maybe like a week. But I guess that kind of is a long time. Because, I mean, you subscribe to the channels. Prob to my channel. Probably for Call of Duty stuff. So I figured, you know, let's let's drop a gameplay I get. I'm, uh, I haven't been playing Call of Duty all that often. And it's not because I don't like it. It's because I just I really need a break from it. I have I have a couple games on my file share, and there's a I think I have a, maybe a free for all or two, a search and destroy, which I haven't played that in ages. And uh, I decided to play it one night, and I got a game like one of my first ones, and it was it's a pretty beast game. But what I'm gonna start off is I guess I should tell you guys about this first. I'm using the Famus with the suppressor, running the spy plane, counter spy plane, napalm for ultimate. Uh, kill streak efficiency is in this game. I run around a lot. I'm actually surprised at how much I run around. And in the lobby, I found another. I mean, he wasn't in my uh, party, but there was a Huppet member, which I was like, hey, that's kind of cool. And he was on my team, and I'm like, I figure, all right, we're gonna kick ass, and we did. And I'm running Flak Jacket Pro. Uh, there's a point in this game where I drop a napalm, and then I I don't move, but uh, that's because I check. Oh, look at that jump shot. I jump a lot in this game too. Um, that's because I check to see if I have Flak Jacket Pro, which prevents me from protects me from fire. So. So that's why I, there's one point where it's kind of like, well, what are you doing? You're not doing anything. And I'll point it out later. Slide of Hand Pro and Marathon Pro f and a Marathon for Ultimate Rushing. Slide of Hand because you got to be fast in those uh, quarters, uh, close quarters, up uh, up close engagements. Got to be quicker than the enemy. And now uh, I run a Claymores, and that's about it. I mean, I end up going 31-4, and four, which is beast, top of the game. Uh, three caps, no defense, because I didn't really need to defend if you this team is horrid and there's a lot of points in this game where they don't really notice me and I, I mean I walk in front of them around them and they're very they're blind as a bat but so yeah what's been going on with my uh, with everything lately I mean I haven't posted Call of Duty video in a while but that's because I, I kinda touched on it upon before like I, I need a little bit of a little bit of break from Call of Duty and also because my disc is slowly cracking. I mean, the same thing happened to my Rock Band 2 CD. But the thing is with that, I had bought so many songs, I really didn't want to stop playing Rock Band. I Like, I always wanted to have like a, those songs available to play in case I ever got the urge. And with Rock Band 2, I could I ended up buying Rock Band 1 for like 5 bucks instead of Rock Band 2. Because Rock Band 2 didn't have that great of songs anyway. Granted, there are songs now that's like, shit, I wish I could play. But it, it wasn't worth the extra 20 bucks for like the 5 songs I wanted to play on that disc. So I was able to buy Rock Band and uh, salvage all my songs so I can play them, which is nice. And I've actually thought about posting maybe Rock Band videos. I don't know. Um, I think that'd be pretty boring to watch. I mean, I don't like to go for full combos. That's too, that's too fucking stressful, if you ask me. Oh, sorry, pardon my language. I'm, I try to keep my Call of Duty videos kind of clean. But with uh, anything else on my channel, I, uh, I, I'm very profane. Look at that guy. He didn't even notice me. Really? And they're all fucking... Uh, Excuse me again. They're all flipping using second chance, and there's one point in this game where I kill a guy and I'm trying to shoot him, but he just dropped in a second chance, and I kill him after I get killed. But yeah, my disc is cracking. So I mean, I don't know if that's from. I imagine it's not from overuse because I play a lot of Skate Three, and uh, that's that disc is holding up fine. But yeah, like I said, the same thing happened on Rock Band too. If, if you guys know a way that can prevent, I mean, there's already a like a little crack through that little clear part in the center of the disc. If you guys know a way to prevent that shit from happening, just let me know because most likely I won't be buying Black Ops again because it's still, I think it's still 55 bucks. And uh, I'd probably just end up buying Call of Duty 4 if I, re if I wanted a Call of Duty just because that shit's cheap. And the other day I had bought, I had posted on my Facebook I'm like, yo, like I'm feeling a bit nostalgic today. So I get call, should I get Call of Duty 4 and Gears of War 2 or Gears of War 2? And one of my uh, my uh, gaming friend, he posted, yo, get Gears of War 2. We'll play over break because I get spring break coming up, which is gonna be nice. And this is the point where I stop and I'm like, wait, start, shoes class, check class. Oh, Flak Jacket Pro, no problem, no problem. But he said, get Gears of War 2, and I ended up getting it. And the GameStop on my other videos, it was scratched up. But I went and I returned it, and I was playing it the other day. And it's such a, like, a slow-paced game, and second chance is standard, which is a pain. Look at this. Flash fail. Boop. Oh, no, concussion fail. Guy thinks he's smooth. He could have jumped over the railing and killed me, but look what he does. He comes around, and he pays for it. Oh, and burped. But, yeah, 
like I say that so much but yeah but yeah but yeah all right anyway I say anyways too I need to start making smoother transitions so I was playing Gears of War 2 the other day and I'm having a lot of fun with that game I want to start I want to do live commentaries with that and I wouldn't really do planned out commentaries with that because I'm not posting incredible scores like going negative is good for me not like in like oh and six but maybe like four and six or like three and six like that's an average game for me uh i played last night my girlfriend was over i went six and three and i was like oh like that's one of the best games i've ever played in that game which is pretty pathetic but there were some moments and i, I do want to start posting that stuff i don't know if you guys would be interested in that but that's probably what i'm going to start posting more often i mean i definitely want to start playing black ops get my black ops footage out keep you guys entertained with that but i do want to branch off into other games because there's only so many times you can watch a match on let's see firing range a domination fire range i don't know about you guys but i'd get bored unless i have some cool stories to tell you but i mean i have some cool stories in my eyes i don't know if you guys would think they'd be interesting but i don't know i just want to like uh, see so this is where the guy goes in second chance and i get fucking pistoled from behind but I do want to start branching out into the other games, and that brings me to the other point, my Let's Play. I'm doing a Let's Play of Skate 3 right now. If you haven't, you guys probably aren't even interested in that. If you're if you're on for the Call of Duty channel, um, you're subscribed for that, you're probably, I don't know, I'll g give it a look. There's some funny moments. It's basically m me just going through the game, just having a lot of fun with it, making stupid jokes, talking in stupid voices, and doing just stupid things in the game. I'm having a lot of fun with it. I know I'm going to go back and watch probably the whole series if I get bored one day. And that's another thing. This channel is because, like, later on, like, maybe in, like, a year later, be like, oh, man, remember that funny thing? Like, oh, let's go back and watch it. And, like, oh, that was funny. But, yeah, it's a very entertaining Let's Play, I think. I mean, I've watched some other Let's Plays, and it's kind of like, man, we got to do this here. Okay, now do this here. I'm just, like, screwing around. I'm, like, I'm making the game funny. Like, I think that's great. And, uh... Just give it a look if you guys haven't. You know, there's one where I'm uh, dominating the competition where I basically, I'm in a competition and I, uh, you're able to punch people in the game, so I basically just beat up my competition so they can't do any tricks, and I think that's, I think that's hilarious. And what else do we got? Oh yeah, another thing. New games coming out, I want to do, I want to do a Let's Play on another game. But the thing is, I want to do a newer game, so maybe it'll attract more people to my channel. What do you guys think I should do? I'm thinking a little bit of Portal 2, but I'd want to play Portal 1 first. But Portal 2 comes out in a month and is a sixty or fifty you know sixty dollar standalone game and I don't know if I could justify spending that on a portal two and uh I hadn't even played portal one and I promised myself I wouldn't do a let's play of portal one until I did finish the let's play of skate three but I don't know how long that's gonna take. Another game so I don't know if I really want to get Portal two. Another game that I'm definitely gonna get is Alice Madness Returns, which is gonna be a sick game. My dad played it on PC when I was younger and I used to watch. That's uh June fourteenth. Portal's April 19th. Um, what else do we got? Gears of War 3. That's looking very promising right now. Picking up Gears of War 2 again, I hated it. And I'm like, oh, this sucks. But now I'm like, you know what? I'm definitely getting Gears 3 now. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. If there's any games out there that... Um, oh, I'm going to have to edit something. Brr, see you later. Alright, that's kind of... I don't know. I just, I just had more to talk to you guys about. But I don't have any more gameplay at this point. But yeah, let me know if you guys would want to see any spe uh, specific games. I'm definitely open... I'm Portal 2, like, I, I'd like to do that, but at the same time, $60 for a game, I'm gonna, I know I'm gonna get frustrated in that, I'm gonna be raging hard, and, like, that's the thing, I'd wanna buy Portal 1 first, and that's 15 bucks, and I have to shell out 60 for Portal 2, and I don't know, I mean, maybe when it drops in price, but the thing, like I was saying earlier, I wanna attract new people to my channel, and the first thing people are gonna look up is, like, Portal 2 when it comes out, and, and hey, they see a Portal 2 Let's Play, oh, let's, let's see how the game plays out, and, you know, I, I just wanna help you guys, and I wanna attract more more subscribers to my channel so by telling me what you guys want to see in for let's plays or any other video ideas I'm having a lot of fun with that I wanted I might even post some some videos of me playing my bass I don't know maybe doing some song covers um, but I want to kind of branch out other than Call of Duty granted I still am gonna do Call of Duty videos but I just want to branch out a little bit more another game is Alice Madness Returns like I said I don't know how many people are gonna be on that I mean that seems like a cult a cult game which is when like there's like a small following with it but it's uh, big enough to get an Xbox title, so that's definitely looking good. And that's like a Alice in Wonderland horror scary shit, which um, is going to be great. And that's going to be very fun. I'm going to get scared in that. I know that. Another game, Gears of War 3. I'm definitely... 
like, I just need a break from Call of Duty. I need a different style of shooter. Gears of War is very, very, very slow paced, but you know, it's fun. And uh, Batman Arkham City, I played the first one and I, oh, such a great game, but I don't know, I don't like single player games because I beat them and then I get bored with them. But I am looking into Arkham City, but that's a lot of money within a short period of time and I'm a little strapped for cash right now, so like, I don't know, what would you guys want to see? Let me know what you guys want to see in this channel. You know, I, I, I need your input. Leave a comment below. Um, I'm not going to ask you to like the video. If, I mean, if you didn't like it, I'm not going to force you to like it. But just leave a comment saying anything, actually. I just I want your guys' feedback, and uh, I want you guys' support. Just let me know, because uh, I know this channel is uh, it's my channel, but I want to make it enjoyable for you guys. Uh, I'd like to look back and watch the videos and like, hey, I, like that was funny. But I also want to look back and be like, hey, like a lot of people enjoyed this too. So just let me know. Let me know what you guys want to see, what you guys think. And uh, yeah, it's up to you guys uh, what comes next. So uh, see you later.